this is gonna make a huge difference in your game because this is a laptop that is optimized for playing games that we can play the game we can have this browser on we can use this program to film ourselves we can edit if it is one thing that i want you to look out for in a laptop I see you, I know that you want laptops because you can use it for your schoolwork, game, while you are traveling, it comes in handy. So this is what we are going to start off with, the best laptops for playing The Sims 4. First of all, I want you to look for gaming laptops. If you're a pro and you already know these details, you can skip this video. This video is mainly addressed to you guys who want to have a better performance, a better gameplay and don't know what to pick, what to choose. I'm not an expert by any means, but I have come to the conclusion that there are certain aspects that you need to keep in mind when choosing a laptop. I just want you to pick your price range. So let's just see if we can find something under $500. It redirected us to the typical laptops and while those work there are better options for us so we switched to 500 to 600 dollars if you want a gaming laptop and it's not in your price range you can also go and take a look into secondhand gaming laptops they are way more affordable a gaming laptop will always 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 run faster running multiple apps at a time for editing so if if you're trying to start a youtube channel start a gaming channel and if you want to edit your videos this is gonna come in handy also if you're big into editing you know photos and photoshop i highly suggest you get a gaming laptop i will tell you what makes the difference this gaming laptop it has this nvidia geforce the graphics card or gpu abbreviated is the one that is going to make your games run more fluidly faster smoother and the images are going to be unmatched but when we are paying for a product we want to make sure that we have the best components that we can get for that price we want to have a good processor we want to have a good gpu good rom we want to have a good storage for our games this one really catches my eye the HP Victus. If it is one thing that I want you to look out for in a laptop is the GPU. Because the GPU can have 4 gigabytes, can have 6 gigabytes, or can have 8 gigabytes, but those are so pricey. We want to aim for the 6 one because this one is in the middle range. If you manage to find a laptop that is between 500 and 700 with 6 gigabyte graphic memory that is a huge deal the second criteria that i want you to look for the rom okay the higher the better obviously but you want to have at least eight gigabytes of rom right now i think that this pair six gigabytes gpu plus 16 gigabytes of rom memory is the sweet spot this hp1 is a simple laptop okay but this HP Victus is a gaming laptop and it has almost the same price. Get yourself a gaming laptop. Again, this is just a recommendation. I'm not saying that you cannot play The Sims 4 on any kind of laptop. What I'm implying is that on a gaming laptop, you will see the difference. If you already want to buy something, why not go for a gaming laptop if it's in the same price range? This one, again, is not a gaming laptop same price range of course it has its advantages which is it's more portable it's lightweight but if you also want to game the gaming laptop is the way to go for you we are going to filter by ram memory because we want to have 16 gigs if possible the hp vectus is kind of trending let's just take a look at these three okay so we have this hp vectus the screen is a decent size it will fit in most backpacks most backpacks come with this size for your laptop you know space it has a 144 hertz display which is great because this means that a refresh rate okay how fast the images appear onto your screen is high a normal monitor would have like 60 or 70 hertz 
this one is a gaming laptop it has 144 which is great the Ryzen's do get a bit hot okay when you're playing so you might need a cooler see how it goes for you if, if you feel like you need a cooler or a laptop standing pad go ahead and do it most importantly we have 16 gigabytes of ROM the higher the ROM the more apps we can run at the same time okay so we have 16 gigs which means that we can play the game we can have this browser on we can use this program to film ourselves we can edit at the same time so it's great to have ROM the ROM memory is always 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 so solicited is always in use okay so you will need that memory of course we have the dedicated graphics card okay most laptops that are office laptops come with integrated graphics cards which means that okay they are good they are portable they are lightweight but each and every laptop serves a purpose this one is more so of a working you know gaming doing editing stuff on it and lightweight one is more so for traveling for writing for doing things that aren't that complex if you will also have a backlit keyboard which if you're all about those vibes you will really like having a backlit keyboard during the night you know it's nice to type on it see she's on the go she's working she has five pounds 2.26 kilograms okay plus the charger it's most probably gonna be three kilograms so take that into consideration if you're planning to travel with it of course the performance is gonna be a lot better okay there's certain compromises that you need to make do you want it to be lightweight and not have like a peak performance do you want it to be a gaming laptop forms but it's a bit heavy now this one has almost the same specs it's a bit pricier this msi one is pricier as well but it has an intel processor so if you're an intel processor fan then you might like it it has a newer gpu so same storage the same rom but i think it's bulkier it has three kilograms so take that into consideration if you're considering this one we're also gonna take a look at best buy because i know that you guys you are looking at best buy we're going to check what deals we can find laptop and computers gaming laptops as per usual it is you know me if you are seeing a laptop that is within the same price range and has a better gpu get the one with a better gpu because the ram this one eight gigs you can always upgrade it in the long run but the gpu cannot be replaced in the future and you also have one terabyte of ssd like this is the perfect deal i love this brand this is not sponsored but i use products from lenovo the screen is amazing it has so many nits it's so bright and nice and i literally grew up with this brand and it has amazing laptops for gaming for editing for photography i really like it i literally never thought i could find a laptop it has so many features within this price sort by this price range okay so these are these are all of the deals between this hp vectors and this lenovo i would say definitely go with the lenovo because it has newer gpu it has one terabyte of ssd which is more storage for you it has an intel okay intel processor you can upgrade rom and you can also add another ssd which is great because it is upgradable the year of release is 2023 this is the latest model and it has such a great price honestly in my opinion in my opinion it has 350 nits most laptops do have around 200 and 300 nits this is such a bright display which means that the colors are gonna be brighter the game is gonna look a lot nicer plus i have never seen 
a laptop with an SSD of one terabyte. We have two memory slots, which means that we can add another eight gig slot. I seek a special list for that because you need to have the same RAM in order for it to run properly. The same brand is what I'm trying to say. It has Windows 11, Wi-Fi, so five pounds to 0.4 kilograms, which isn't that much. Those are my three recommendations for laptops. Let's just see if we can find something with this graphics card. The Acer ones are also good. We have this one, which has a slightly older processor because the other one had the 13th generation of Intel. This one is from last year. It has this GPU, only eight gigs of RAM, only 512 gigabytes of SSD. So if you like one brand more than another, you do you, but I really like that. I really like that offer with the Lenovo one. Again, this is not sponsored. I'm doing this because I truly want you to be aware when you're making a choice to buy something because I did not know what to pick and I had to inform myself and do the research and see like, okay, what components are the most important when it comes to gaming, when it comes to playing The Sims 4. So I truly hope this helped. The next video is going to be about PCs. PCs are way more affordable when it comes to having, you know, higher components, higher specs components, but the drawback is the fact that you cannot carry it around. Let me know if you have any other suggestions for further videos. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you very, very soon.